podcasting na. Number one podcast in Northwest. As you guys can see, we're not in our usual uh, location where we, where we do interviews. We're in a new location. If you guys can see now, it's proper. We just show at the end. And we have two guests here with us. I'm, okay. I'm, I'm not gonna see. I'm not gonna tell you guys who they are. They're gonna tell you guys who they are. So, bro, so what are you guys not? Nice. Uh, always, always, always nice. Okay, so um, tell the people what you guys do. Who you guys are? Yes, right. Um, this is one man. Um, go by the name of. Kanye Langa, Kanye Langa, who's joined here as one man, musical duo, we make music, we are artists, we literally do everything down, like actors, models, we make music, if you're not to see, I'm gonna do that, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna do that, yeah. That's, you know, so. Mm. Wait, let me, let me take this thing out. As you guys heard, these two are artists, they, to me, man. I've known, I think I'm not gonna say I've known them for too long because I haven't really known you guys. I just saw so you guys um, yeah. are actors. But then I also remember you guys are actors, yeah. me, like artists, yeah. influencers. Sure. Bro, these guys do everything. So I wanna know, how do you guys manage to do everything at once? Like acting, music, and all of that? Um, I don't know. I think you are driven by the passion. Yeah. You know, you don't really like. I don't know like things just happen you find yourself in a certain space where you're like damn i'm in love with this you you do it you know yeah, so yeah. yeah it also <coughs> you cannot miss opportunities just because you are lazy to work mm-hmm. you get me mm-hmm. but if anything comes away you just gotta grab it with both hands because at the end of the day we just try to make it to the top mm. oh, yeah. mm-hmm. now nah, that's great bro so wait guys now nah, i want you guys to name all the songs that you guys have recorded how many songs oh, do you guys have oh, out right now? Yeah, actually, showings, you guys have a lot of tracks. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. actually, we have like an interesting story to yeah. tell, mm-hmm. Yeah. right? Yeah. First, when we were making music, mm-hmm. we were recording as individuals. Yeah. I was my own artist. Mm-hmm. He was in his own artist, yeah. mm-hmm. right? Um, then, in 2016, I recorded my first song. Mm-hmm. He did the same. Mm-hmm. And then 2017, like we kept m- making music, you know, individually. So mm. 2018, did music mm. just a little bit because we we're focusing on school. Mm. 2019, that's when we became a duo. Yeah. Mm. As one man, mm. we got it our first track, did it to trip, mm. you know, and from there we've been like getting mm. gigs. Do, do, do you know what's the crazy part? Yeah. When we started to be joined, mm-hmm. A whole lot of opportunities started coming yeah, our way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the craziest part. Yeah, yeah. I, I guess yeah. it's true when they say unity is power. It's, yeah, it's power. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, of course. And like, I feel like the fact that you guys are twins and the fact that you guys do basically the same shit. You guys trip the same. You guys <laughs> yeah. talk the same. You know. Yeah. So I feel like if you like the moment you guys collaborated and did music together, that also brought a lot of attention to yeah, you guys. Facts, facts. I mean? facts. So yeah. And then the, you guys are saying you guys are first a duo in 2019. Yeah, yeah. So how did the name One Man come about? <laughs> I mean, like, yeah, we're Such twins. A, yeah. yeah. Right? Mm. <laughs> we're twins, so yeah. what you see is one man. Mm. Yeah. Mm. You know, mm. like, mm. I don't think there is any other better name that we could have came up with. Mm. Yeah. One time we had um, an radio interview. Yeah. We explained this and it was like, one man means one in two. Mm. You know, it's more like two personalities mm-hmm. in one in yeah. one man. Mm. Do you get me? Yeah, I get yeah. So it's yeah, it's just that, bro. Just yeah, no, that, yeah, that's crazy. Cause <laughs> we like like when I saw one man, it, like a lot of things came to my mind. Oh, yeah. Like, okay, it's two niggas 
and they call themselves one man, but also because they're twins, you understand what I mean? Yeah, so it's yeah, like, yeah. okay, now nah, I get it, but it's a cool concept, like when you think about it, you yeah, understand? Yeah, so you need to think thoroughly yeah, about yeah, it, and then you'd be like, okay, yeah, one man is it's quite a dope name, you understand what I mean? Thanks, man. Okay, and then I saw when you guys are acting in the So Beat the Black Door. Tell us, tell us the experience about that. How is it working with all these celebrities and... Bro. <laughs> <laughs> Bro. Don't get me wrong. Now. I know the black door. Hey, there's a lot of things happening. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> things happening. Shout out to the black door. Yeah. Shout out to the cast, directors, mm. um, crew, like everyone. Like everyone. Shout like, out. Really, really like. Appreciate the opportunity. Mm. Um, so I remember... I'm mean, like, that was God, bro. Mm. We mm. didn't do much. That was God. We just found ourselves like in that space and we we're like, mm. damn. You know, we learned a lot. Mm-hmm. Um, met like big people. Mm-hmm. You know, like, I don't know what Mark could say about it. It was like a dope experience. Yeah, yeah. So, so you guys now, let me say, what, what celebrities did you guys actually uh, uh, fuck with when you met them? Like, you, you met them and you were like, damn, this is actually a dope person. You understand know what I mean? I think everyone. Everyone. Yeah, yeah, everyone. Everyone is just different in their own way. Mm, 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 go to what they do. Mm-hmm. And mostly, we didn't go there to as like we knew what we were doing. Mm. Okay, we knew what we were doing, but mm-hmm. mostly we were focused on learning mm. rather than just us offering there. Mm-hmm. You know, but yeah, we know at the end of the day, it's not only about taking, mm-hmm. you know, but it's also giving while you take you give while you take you give while you take you give you know so it's yeah mm. but everything was just so did you guys just find yourself in a opportunity that okay like you just came in you met the celebrity and they're like yo come to the black door or what happened how did you guys end up being in the black door well they were actually looking for twins yeah oh, they were looking right. for twins That's yeah. how we specifically got there. yeah they were looking for twins um now we're not trying to Go deep, mm-hmm. but they were looking for. They teams. were looking for yeah. teams and they found, and they found, yeah. yeah, our management yeah. just did mm. the thing. So, yeah. And then when you guys saw like in the wait when they when they were looking for you guys, did you guys know the black door? Like, did you already know the the show? Nah, it was nah, not shot yet. Started. Oh, it was not shot yet. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Now that makes a lot of sense. And then when when it was shot and you guys saw the whole concept and how it is, how did you guys take all that in? I mean, I'm not gonna lie, but if, I, if, if, if that was me, bro, I think. <laughs> hey, it's a lot of things. Yeah, that nah, I, mean. um, I think we just had to understand that it's art. Mm. Yeah. Mm. You know, like we just had to understand that we are just like showing mm. real life to people what happens behind the door. Yeah. Mm. You know, what people do like on the carpet. Mm. Like, you understand? Mm. So we just like, at first it was like, damn. Damn. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. but as soon as like you see the storyline mm-hmm. rolling, mm-hmm. you see that oh, cool, you know, mm-hmm. and then that's how I think that's how we actually like <coughs> felt like okay, cool, let's do it. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. All right, bro. So now let, let, let's let's get into this. All the performances that you guys have done, which which one which one is the best performance that like the the the, the, the location that you guys have ever been to? I think. That's a good question. Mm. Um, Which way? The Sense in Sensen. Sensen. Facts. Yeah. yeah. Facts. What happened in Sensen? Um, so there is a club called yeah. The Sense, right? Mm-hmm. I don't know if it's is, still called The yeah, Sense. I think yeah, it's called that's what I wanted to say. Sukasa something. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <coughs> we used to have like um, Sunday situations. Mm-hmm. Shout out to my nigga. What was the Pressure. Sunday? Pressure. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Pressure mm-hmm. Katam Shook. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, yeah. Nigga. Plug this, mm-hmm. we went there, did our team, mm-hmm. you know, and yeah. Yeah, we yeah. also the crowd was like, crazy. The yeah, I know the crowd. Yeah, I saw videos love. of them on yeah. Instagram, they're going crazy. Yeah, yeah, the yeah, love yeah. was crazy. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, but at the end of the day, we just appreciate the opportunity, mm. the love, and staying humble at all times. Mm. And how do you guys see yourself, like, with all that you guys are doing, acting, influencing, artists, and everything like that? And your day-to-day life <laughs> when people come to you. Do you know what's the cra- craziest part uh-huh. of it? We don't even consider ourselves as influencers. Mm. Bro. <laughs> but people just put us there yeah. and we're like, all right, okay. But it is, rock with that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah you guys look like influencers because like, if you check out your Instagram and everything, you're fit, you understand? So oh, yeah. people would consider you like, Thank oh, you, he's an influencer. Thank so they nah. Thank and then your day-to-day like, life when people come to you like yo one man or oh, they seen you somewhere and everything like that how do you guys take that bro 
<laughs> bro. <laughs> now, um, I feel like we've always been because before we did music, mm -hmm. we were playing soccer, mm -hmm, and yeah. even like in the soccer like field, mm -hmm. if I can put it that way, it was just it was always been a vibe, you know. Even in always, high school, dog. Mm -hmm. Even in high, high school, school, you know, we've yeah. always met people and like, yo, dog, you know. Mm -hmm. So I don't think it was hard to actually like adapt to that because mm -hmm. we've mm -hmm. always been used to like big vibes and like yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so i don't see any much change though mm. <laughs> yeah so okay and then wait i want you guys to tell the people your channel because i tried to look for your channel i found one channel where you guys uploaded a song i think it was the only song there. yeah that's yeah. the only song is that the original uh channel not really okay. we are but we will you know work on our youtube channel mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah there is something coming up mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. um so fire fire music fire yeah everything fire. dog oh yeah everything yeah yeah, yeah. you know so there's gonna be like music mm -hmm. gonna be like just our one-man content mm -hmm. yeah you know one-man content mm -hmm. yeah so they should just look up for the new channel mm -hmm. they shouldn't focus on that because yeah, yeah you know you know how it goes yeah mm. all right and then who's who's your guys role model i don't know if you guys as one man have a specific role model <laughs> each have individual role models well for me mm -hmm. it has to be michael b jordan bro, <laughs> <laughs> bro. Yeah. well uh musically i would say tory lanes mm. he's, so he's, yeah. he's also also like, well for me musically mm -hmm. it has to be cp mm. wait you said Tory Lanez, man. Yeah. Guys, you know that stereotype when people say, hey, niggas who listen to Tory Lanez, hey. Because <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, I don't know which one of you niggas are, man. But, like, um, you guys know. Yeah. yeah. There's this picture that he posted, man. Um, I don't know who it was, but he mentioned, he mentioned, like, the whole thing. And he was like, I don't know, he wanted to come here or something like that. And he he messaged one of you guys and he was like, yo, let's, let's go shoot or do something. Yeah. And then I don't know which one it is. And then you sent him a picture. I don't know which one of you guys is it. Uh, with, with your own shit. Picture. Nah, that's not how it went. Oh, no, it's you. <laughs> that's not how it went. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not saying like, 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 like. Yeah, in, I get what you're talking okay, about, yeah. but that's not how it went. Mm. Yeah. What was the question again? I didn't ask a question, I was just saying, oh, you know, everything yeah, like that. Yeah. yeah. Okay, but then I get you guys. And then let's say when people don't know who you guys are, like in the. Uh, uh, well, you guys, are you guys currently studying? What's up? Are you guys currently studying? Like, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so let's say your teachers or your professors and stuff like that, don't, don't they know who's who? The thing about Vazity, like they don't care. Like, yeah, they, they don't, don't care. care. And, I, and I figured that out. Like nobody cares. <laughs> yeah. They don't care. No, God. Nobody yeah. cares. Like they don't care. Yeah. You know. So, I I think for us it's just like you go to class, you mm. do what you do, and then mm -hmm. you leave. You leave. Mm. Yeah. You know. And I mean, like we do sit together. They're mm. like we do go to same classes. Mm -hmm. You know. And they don't really like ask I L twins. I L. You know. Because mm -hmm. it's like. I don't know. I I think they also understand that now. We just here to study. Mm -hmm. Like let's do, yeah, yeah. So, mm. yeah. I, I think like they would actually pay attention. Teachers would pay attention like mm. in high school, you know, because yeah. like obviously yeah. high, high school, school, high school, like, school. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. High school yeah. yeah. So they would pay like a whole lot of attention, mm. not just in university. Mm. Yeah. Okay. So what what advice would you give to 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 let me not just say teenagers, but people who would come here and then have um what's this a feeling where they feel like everybody's watching me because like you know when you come when you first come here it's like every, like everybody's doing their own stuff peer pressure you see people yeah. with cars you see people with job you know <coughs> what would what advice would you give to that person um stay true to yourself mm -hmm. facts stay humble mm -hmm. facts um most importantly put god first facts mm -hmm. that's all yeah now bro that's you guys heard it here first so I'm not gonna say much, but to me, y'all see these two bros are dope as fuck. <laughs> Thanks, man. Thanks, bro. Thanks, but, man. Yeah. So besides music, acting, and the day like the basic shit you guys do, what else do you guys do in secret that people don't know? Hi, bro, bro, bro. <laughs> man, just playing. Yeah, I'm just playing. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> shout out to every women mm. we don't do that hey. yeah, um yeah. so nah i think we don't really plan our days mm -hmm. you know 
we do have school in between so mm-hmm. I think it revolves around our free time you know mm-hmm. like we literally do anything dog like mm-hmm. you, we don't have like a fixed plan mm-hmm. yeah sportiness like that yeah you know so I, I don't know I wouldn't really tell you like our day-to-day life mm-hmm. you know but all we know is that like we like to work mm-hmm. you know if there is work like let's do it yeah. you know like let's do it and <coughs> one thing about us we like to create our own vibe mm. and, I, and, I, and I noticed that yeah, yeah. we don't just okay wake up on a Monday if mm. there's no vibe then we're like ah it's a Monday there's mm. no vibe yeah. if there's no vibe we're gonna make a vibe you're gonna make yeah. a vibe yeah, yeah. That's yeah. nah that's dope that's dope actually and then I saw you guys were in the King Omo video smashing pairs how did you guys get in that though like did you guys just see him and just go or did they invite you in or? not even dog we, you know what happened yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so um shout out King Omo though mm. oh, yeah. um we were okay I remember on that Friday we were from school mm. we were writing an, an assignment or yeah. a test mm. so um it was held at campus key mm. right mm. so we went there like to watch because i remember there was this other hand that mm-hmm. called me mm-hmm. she was like yo there was a smash or pass like mm-hmm. i was gonna come through to watch we're like yeah mm-hmm. damn it now we came through so now we see king omar he's like yo geez are we what's up are y'all gonna be in the video like mm-hmm. okay cool, let's do it yeah, yeah you know but our plan was not to be in the video yeah, we'll you know we just like Dude, I was just ran now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. And then uh, we just had to go and change. And surprisingly, it just came out. Mm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. The image was yeah. crazy. Yeah. <laughs> but then I also thought, oh, this busy hand, eh, this hand. Now, this, let me see you guys what this hand does. Eh. <laughs> you see the twins, this hand walks up and it's like, no, pass. And it smashes the other. And I'm not seeing anything. What's wrong with this hand? How do you, oh, yeah, how do you yeah. feel about like, this, hand, eh, this hand? Now, for me, special pass is not something that I take to heart. Yeah. Or yeah. something most that niggas, I take to heart. Most people take it to heart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. most people take it to heart. Yeah. That when I say pass, someone falls, they need to have a beef with me. Mm, or, mm, you know, but it's just crazy. But for me, it was just like, Nah, it's cool. Just do this shit for entertainment. Yeah. So nothing less, nothing more. Mm. Yeah. yeah. That hand was dizzy, <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Okay, and then uh, uh, do you guys have those connections now with King Omo? Or it was just a uh, smash and pass video. Nah, when we see each other's vibes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Every, every time we just like it's vibes, it's vibes, it's vibes, it's yeah. vibes. Yeah. And then what other artists or influencers or let me say celebrities would you guys like to meet? Hmm. Uh, I think it has to be pretty ugly. Pretty ugly. Yeah. Why? For me, I think it's Casper, though. Yeah. See? For me, no, I that, think no, it's that's Casper. a debate. Yeah, because <laughs> I fuck with Casper, you, but you, then again, pretty ugly is pretty dope. Yeah. Understand? So, what? Well, I just feel like pretty ugly mm-hmm. is on his lane or something. Mm. You Fine. know? Mm. Yeah. Vibe. Yeah. In terms yeah. of music or. Music. Everything about him. Oh, everything yeah, about him. Yeah, like, yeah. I don't really have a lot to say about mm, him, mm. but I just like the vibe. Mm. Deep the vibe. You know, why do you fuck with Casper? Nah, I feel like Casper. Like, we can't argue about that, bro. Yeah, like, no, nah, we can't argue about we can't, that. We can't argue about that. <laughs> yeah. You know. Yeah. Um, I think he has like proven himself multiple mm. times. Yeah, facts. that he's literally yeah, like, facts. you know, like mm. we can't compare to any, him to anybody mm. at this moment. Mm-hmm. You know, so I think like Casper is pretty cool. Mm-hmm. Oh you know? shit! Do you know what the craziest part? Mm-mm. They actually had a fight. They had a fight. That's what. Oh, yeah. 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 And I'm like, yeah. You guys, yeah. You guys, like different people who who are who had a fight. Yeah. So how did you guys feel about that whole fight? Who was supporting who? Because we yeah. all know how it how it ended. <laughs> <laughs> we all know how it ended. Let's so, cut it. Let's yeah. cut it. <laughs> we all know how it ended. So I want to know how did how did you guys feel about that whole fight? Nah, it was a dope fight. Yeah, there's a dope fight. Yeah, but hey, I was ready for it, bro. I, I was ready to watch. Like, yeah, I was yeah. ready. I was really, like, yeah. but I mean, like, it went how it went. Mm. Shout out. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nah. Shout out. And then, um, so what plans do you guys have from now on? Like, what's your next steps? Um, on oh, next month we're mm. dropping a song, mm-hmm. which was mm-hmm. and day to be announced soon. Mm, mm, yeah, mm, mm, mm. yeah, just that. Yeah. On all for social now. media platforms. On now. all social media yeah. platforms. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you guys heard it. Make sure you go stream it. Make sure you go like it. Make sure you go 
do all of that and one take man it. throws one it on them with rocket. You guys are rocking it, yeah. And shout out to Tommy Debs. Mm. Yes, sir. Yeah. Mm. We, we, Who's that? That's my nigga. Um, some someone that we are work, we we were working with, mm. yeah, and came song. up with the song Josie and them. Mm. We did our thing, like mm. you know, like yeah. yeah. Okay, and then how long have you guys been in Porch? Because I I I I heard yeah. that you guys just moved in recently. Yeah, yeah. like yeah. three months. This year, yeah, yeah. three months ago. <laughs> months. Like, yeah, this is our third month actually. Mm. Yeah. And how how has it been like around here, bro? It's like, <laughs> it's, it's like we've been here for it's like we've been here for like like two years, bro. Yeah, yeah. like the, the way is just, just crazy. Like, mm, yeah, mm, mm, mm. yeah. Where were you before you came in? Joburg. Oh, Joburg. Yeah. How was it at Joburg though? It is dope. I feel like people are working there, bro. Mm. Yeah, people are working there. Bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. know, um, this is why you'll find most people move to Joburg because mm. that's where like the shit goes is, down. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. you know, people are working there. You know, we just came here because of school, mm-hmm. you know, and yeah, mm. we seem to enjoy it. I mean, so the same energy that you guys get here, people will be like, yo, can I get a picture with you? And what you, what you, what you guys yeah, getting with Yeah, same vibe. Yeah, same yeah. vibe, dog. Yeah, that's yeah. crazy. Hey, you see, you guys gotta work hard for this. <laughs> you guys gotta go. You guys gotta work hard. Shut yeah, up. Mm. And then, so, between, wait, do you guys get your income, like money, from all everything you guys do? Or do you guys have specific things you guys do that makes, that gives you guys income? Okay. For us, mm-hmm. it's not really about money. Mm-hmm. You know, whatever you see us doing, mm-hmm. it's not really about money. Mm-hmm. You know, I mean, like there are people we make, we do make money though. Yeah, make money though. Yeah, we do make money, mm-hmm. right? Um, but that's not the whole point. You yeah, know? like yeah, we're just doing what we love. Yeah, you know, yeah, we feel yeah. like if there's work, let's do it. Mm. Yeah. You know, um, if money comes, like. Yeah, Damn. that's important. Yeah, you know, that's the type so, of mindset they gotta have. Yeah. yeah, sometimes God can just give you an opportunity, mm. you know, mm-hmm. to either test your. I don't know, but <coughs> things just happen. Mm. Mm. You know, like you can just. I, I don't know how to put this, but God can just give you an opportunity, mm-hmm. you know, but because you are. Filled with the idea of getting money from it, then mm-hmm. you lose the opportunity. Then, what yeah, you're gonna do? You miss the opportunity. Yeah. yeah. So sometimes it's just opportunities. One opportunity comes with other opportunities. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You get me. Mm-hmm. So. Yeah. One door can open Another. a whole lot of doors. Mm-hmm. You know. Yeah. So it's not really about the money. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. That's the type of mindset they gotta have because a lo- that's that's actually what we say a lot in the podcast and that's the motivation that we give them because you're not supposed to go into something thinking about money. Yeah. Facts. Because then you're never gonna get what you want from it. Yeah. You know what I mean? yeah. So when it comes to either doing let's say this podcast for example, or somebody rapping, artists and all these other people, when you do something you're not supposed to just do it because of the money. <coughs> yeah. And you might find that somebody who's doing it just for fun can make more than you. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. So you just need to do what you love <coughs> and make sure you stay consistent with it. Yeah. yeah and there's this other quote that I read mm-hmm. and that I know of. Mm-hmm. It states, um, if you have passion mm-hmm. for something, you will never feel like you're working. Mm. Facts. Ooh, yeah. 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 Facts. Yeah. That's facts. You I don't feel I like you're working hard, bro. Yeah. Nah, that's a dope one. Yeah. So if you do something you love, you will never feel the pressure. Yeah, and I feel like most people that are successful mm. right now, mm-hmm. they started like rapping for free, bro. Yeah, performing they for did. free. Yeah, you know they get like people who scout them mm. when they were doing those things for free. Mm-hmm. You know, so I mean, like if people want to chase money mm-hmm. away, that's cool. you know, but I think it has more power mm-hmm. if you have passion for it. Yeah, mm-hmm. you won't even get tired when days are dark. <coughs> Mm-hmm. You know, you won't feel like giving up. I mean, like there are times where you feel like, damn, yeah. I've been running this lap for way too long now. Yeah. You know, but for me, I believe that passion drives you down. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. And then, um, when when you guys, what what's your what was your first dream that you guys wanted to do besides what you guys are doing now? Our first what? Dream. Like, what did you want to become? <sighs> what did you start with? Yeah, I mean, like, I, I feel like we're not really, like, into the <coughs> entertainment industry. Mm-hmm. We didn't choose to be like, oh, I want to make music, you know. We've always <coughs> been, like, schoolboys, mm-hmm. you know. Yeah. We've always been like, okay, cool. 
we want to study law mm -hmm. and just like be in offices or whatever mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. but i don't know life just like took its own yeah, yeah, and yeah, then yeah. we found ourselves like okay cool you know there's how it turned so, out so yeah. yeah um shout out and then would you say you 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 okay and uh uh, uh happy with how life turned out yeah Fox. yeah 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 what, what do you love about your current life <laughs> I think it's us. Mm. Everything that is happening is us. Yeah. Mm. yeah. You get me? Mm. So there's nothing that comes our way and we just feel like we have to adjust to it. Mm. Yeah. But we feel like it's something that that is us. Mm. Yeah, and I feel like every time we just feel the need to give people the real us. Yeah. yeah. You know, so that's why we just like come to like every time to just like be us because what yeah. you was yeah. us yeah. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. and know. another thing <coughs> that i was thinking mm -hmm. about is that god can never give you something mm -hmm. that is not yours Facts. oh yeah yo Facts. yeah mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. if this shit is for you mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it'll always find a way yeah, yeah yeah that's what i'm trying to say yeah no I'm gonna think about that. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna think about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, God will never give you something that doesn't belong to you. Yeah, so. facts. Yeah. And then, um, I, I ran out of fucking questions because I'm trying to understand uh, when you guys work together, like, do you guys do everything together, like, always together? Yeah. Yeah. Bro, that's yeah. the craziest part, dog. Like, dog. everything. Together. It's like everything. You guys do, like, everything together. Yeah, bro. <laughs> that's crazy. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I mean, like sometimes we do be looking out for things where we differ, mm -hmm. but it's hard, bro. Yeah, because like, mm. it's like then one know, man, like, one yeah. man. Yeah, it's one, one man. man. It's giving one man. Mm. <laughs> mm. Nah, get yeah, that, so. bro. So if they were all your fans here now, or maybe let me say the crowd right here, and they wanted motivation to start grinding and and maybe they need motivation to start doing these things maybe they want to start a business maybe they want to get into the music industry or the acting or the whatever what motivation would you guys give them don't stop mm. facts don't stop we have dreams for a reason mm. and you wouldn't have a dream if it was not gonna happen mm -hmm. you know mm. just that us as people lose it along the way mm -hmm. you know mm. us as people want there is like easy things mm -hmm. we just want things to move smoothly mm. you know we never mm. want to work hard mm. you know but in all don't stop mm. don't stop here yeah. yeah don't stop guys you guys heard the motivation here and i don't want to say too much you guys heard it you guys heard the names you guys heard the wait guys give them your ig before we end things out because i oh, want yeah. them to know where they, they can find you guys um you can follow our joint account at mm. one man underscore official yes sir in the visual accounts at kanye langa kanye langa underscore you know what it is yes sir and with that said guys thank you guys for watching the interview and thank you guys for supporting us make sure you like subscribe and share and uh yeah guys thank you for having us on the podcast thanks, thanks man Thanks, man. Right, so you guys keep doing what you're doing because a, a lot of people fuck with you guys thanks, <laughs> so man. thanks man. yeah guys you, you keep doing what you're doing and they keep doing what you're doing guys and uh until next time you also keep doing what, what you're doing, doing. <laughs> 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 yeah. yeah thanks oh, yeah. so yeah guys until the next interview easy peace
Ay, I want you to accept Jiva. Ay, I want you to accept.